Okay, that grind uh, cleaned these jaws up. They look great. There. They do. So, I'll take and put this bar in it. And uh, see how the runout is. Now this is the pinion I found uh, it would take uh, the least amount to grind the jaws after getting the body running true. Okay, the body's running within two thousands. That magic industrial number. Okay, now I'm rotating this, feeling for any grit, dirt, just kind of pushing it back. Then I'll snug it tight enough to machine it. Okay, let's get... Uh, We'll roll it up here. See where we're at. Okay, what are we doing here? About in the middle, I guess. Yeah, that's a lot better. Yeah. Close enough. Okay, let's see where we're at here. I'll roll it. I'm looking at... Looks like one thousandths. Just kind of settled over there. I say it's less than... One half thousandths at the most. One half thousandths. Okay, let's move this thing out to the end and see where we're at. Uh, hard to move this big spindle sometimes. It is well within one thousandths, I think. And we'll see. Right on the mark, now it's coming back over. Just about a thousandths and a half run out. Let's see if we roll it over to the high spot. Right about there. I wonder if we can just push it true. <laughs> Might have to give it a wrap. That got it. It got it within a thousandths. So a little bit of pressure and a wrap will true that up. This is a very successful grind on this chuck that's probably 50, 60 years old. Okay, the phone's ringing. Gotta go.